The comedy show that wants to end the stigma of mental illness, and it's done so brilliantly. Uh, Courtney, stand by with all the details. Okay, so you think about uh, mental health and you think about suicide. Sometimes, you know, that, that it comes up in conversation. Do you ever tie those things in with comedy? Well, that's why you guys do. We've that got is. one degree of separation. Brad and Victoria, thank yeah. you so much for coming in this thank morning. Thank you for having us again. Now, explain that one degree of separation that you talked um, about. Everyone's connected to depression and suicide. Yeah. You know, it's that one degree. If you don't struggle, you know somebody who mm -hmm. does. We're all connected to it. And, uh, and everybody has a story about yeah. somebody they know that struggles or that they've lost. And, yeah. uh, you know, that's, uh, that's why the name of the show, One Degree of Separation, a funny look at depression and suicide. That, I love the title because it is provo provocative. It is. It is. On purpose. Yeah. On purpose, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and I like the way that it's kind of like the spoonful of sugar. To help the medicine go down. Absolutely, right? absolutely. So we use the format of the show. It's always four comedians. As a matter okay. of fact, today is our tonight will be our five year anniversary of our very so first cool. show awesome. on <laughs> the same stage at Laughs Unlimited. And we always have four comedians, and uh, everybody comes out, does five minutes of comedy. We just mm -hmm. want you to laugh yeah. and meet us in our happy place. There's no depression on stage. Okay. Okay. Then we come back out and we answer five questions about depression. And we got those questions from interviewing doctors and psychiatrists, psychologists. What would you want to see talked about if you had four people on stage that have no boundaries? Mm. Because we'll talk key. about anything. That's where anything. The magic happens. There's not a yes. right. And you guys have been together. You've been married for a little over five years, but yes. together for yeah. for a decade. Um, and you say, Victoria, you're not a comedian. No. But <laughs> the partnership between the two of you helps when stuff gets hard. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. And it's taken us years to learn how to talk about it. Yeah. You know, going yeah. through a lot of hard stuff. Um, talk to me about the different groups that you're trying to connect with. Through the show or even through your travels? Everyone. Yeah. Yeah, there's no group. No one's you know, immune. We do sixth graders. Um, we just got back from Boston a few weeks ago for, mm -hmm. the, for 100 command sergeant majors. These are like the equivalent of a general. It's the highest rank you can achieve yeah. enlisted. And we were their suicide prevention training. Um, we just got hired by the California prison industry mm -hmm. to do suicide prevention training for their new employees. Um, we have a meeting with the FBI tomorrow That's to incredible. talk about doing suicide yeah. prevention training for them. We've done, we've done a keynote for 1,000 school teachers at the yeah. Disneyland Hotel this last year. So there's no group wow. from, matter of fact, when we did the Army, we were in New Orleans, uh, they interviewed us, a media interview, and she goes, so you do this for sixth graders? I go, yeah. <laughs> she goes, you're doing the Army today. I go, yeah. <laughs> she goes, so how will you change it? I go, we don't. We don't. The, the, the humor will be a little more, not dirty, but it'll be more adult sure. oriented for yeah. the first part. I go, but the, when we answer the questions, those kids know what we're talking about. Yeah, yeah. Because mental yeah. health is health. Yes. It's right. healthcare, yes. right? Yeah. Yeah. Right. And when you, can, when you can get people to open up and talk about it, mm -hmm. it's changing and saving their lives. Okay. Yeah. You know, it's just incredible the after effects of our shows, watching students go to their principals or to their counselors and saying, hey, I'm like them. I need yeah, help. That's me. You know, that's yeah, me. That's I don't me. want to be here. Ah, yeah. We've had principals say, you know, you can tell which kids are struggling, but I never would have thought that kid who would come forward, he goes, yeah. I thought he was fine, and he's the one that... And that's why this is so necessary. Yeah, so necessary. yeah. And All laughter right. changes your brain. It, it literally does. changes the chemistry in your brain. That's why we laugh the first part of the show. It opens up your brain and makes you receptive to receive information. I love the approach. I love yeah. it. It's one degree of separation. Uh, the show's tonight at Laughs Unlimited, yep. 7 o'clock. Uh, so you can link, all, we're linked all the information to our website, gooddaysacramento.com, under show info and today's date. Get your tickets. And if you are interested in having uh, one degree of separation come out uh, to your group, uh, to, uh, you know, just kind of reach out to even uh, school, folks that you know, schools, whoever. yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, you guys, you, you don't discriminate. No. Because the laughter's no, for everybody. No, yeah. And neither does depression. Mm, and there it is. Good point. That's why you're married to her. I know. <laughs> She's the Why are you having me on? Because you'll see. <laughs> I love it. Thank you guys for coming Thank in. Thank you. Cody, back That is brilliant. Yeah. Brilliant stuff. Thank you so much.